using STEERS AEIR, RNs that have never submitted an emissions inventory or have not submitted in several years. The Web EI system can be used to submit an initial emissions inventory, meaning the first EI ever submitted for an RN, not just the first time submitting through Web EI. For a site that needs to submit an initial EI, the company that owns or operates the RN should contact the TCEQ EAS section to begin the process of setting up the RN in the STARS database so that the processing necessary to make the EI accessible through Web EI can be done. This setup process may require the company to provide the EAS section with either the core data form, CDF, used to establish the RN, or the EAS section's general account information and contact information forms. General account information and contact information forms can be found on the EAS website at www.tceq dot texas dot gov slash air quality slash point hyphen source hyphen ei slash psei dot html if an existing rn that ceased ei reporting at some point in the past needs to return to active reporting status the process is basically the same as an initial EI. The owner-operator of the RN should contact the EAS section to begin the processing necessary to make the EI accessible through STEERS, AIER. Depending when the last EI was submitted for the RN, some information in STARS may be outdated and need updating before processing can occur. This updating may require the company to provide the EAS section with either a CDF or a general account information and contact information forms. The EAS section can be contacted at 512 239-1773 or psinvent at tceq.texas.gov.